Good morning and welcome back to another Joe Salcedo vlog here at Eckerd College. If you're new to the channel here, once again, my name is Joe Salcedo. I'm a current sophomore at Eckerd College and I'm here to vlog my experiences and things that go on throughout the three years. And I'll probably keep on vlogging after. I don't know, it's kind of fun. Today is a Friday here on campus. It's been quite of a long week actually. It was my first full week here at Eckerd. I pretty much spent the week focusing mainly on my class and stuff like that. We're actually taking a whole college class in three weeks, so you can imagine it's pretty intense. But I figured it's almost the weekend and I've got some pretty exciting things planned today. So I figured I'd take you along and you guys can see what's going on. Can I just take a moment to show you how beautiful our campus is? Like, it's pretty awesome. Okay, so about two and a half hours later, I got most of the homework done, but for whatever reason, some of it is broke. So in the instructions, it says we're supposed to do the exercises for this, but then when you click on it, it brings me to a broken page. So I emailed the professor, hopefully he'll get back to me soon. With that said, it's time to do something fun. Let's go sailing. I think it's on. Hi guys, I'm on a boat. It's a sailboat, see? Today we're going sailing with my wonderful, amazing friend, Ariana, who's behind the camera I'm right now. <laughs> She's my camera, camera woman. So we're just rigging up the boat and getting ready to go out. We really only have like 45 minutes of boat time. So we're gonna, we're gonna give her the crash course today, see how it goes. Everything's pretty much on the boat. I took all the covers off, did a quick, brief equipment check. Equipment, equipment. <laughs> Everything looks pretty good and uh, we'll see what happens. Oh my god. Oh, rip. Oh my god, we already got an accident. <laughs> Can you give me a. Now we have to try and get this started. I'm gonna wait until after I get my hands clean. <laughs> give you a brief crash course of how to sail. So, oh my god, I'm gonna crash. <laughs> there's two main components that you use to drive the boat. You have your steering. The rudder is under the boat. It's this little piece that moves back and forth that deflects the water. If you move the tiller to the left, your boat's gonna go to the right. Vice versa, if you move your boat, your tiller extension to the right, it's gonna go left. The next, but also equally as important part, is this rope that you have right here. This is called there the is another, wait, what? You have to make sure your boom is positioned so that way your sail can catch the wind the best that it can. If you're going upwind, you want to sail as close as you can to it without, without the sail losing the force of the wind. You'll notice that the sail loses the force of the wind once when the sail starts flapping like this. You see how it's kind of flapping around? Yeah. I'm going to give this to you. I'm going to give this to you as well. No, 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 <laughs> no, no. And then... You just, okay, so if you hold the, the tiller extension in one hand, you hold this in your right hand. And now no, you're no, also. No, no. <laughs> I was just gonna say, you might have a hard time seeing. Thank you. Thank you. I forgot to look! Where are we steering? <laughs> so you're gonna steer right towards that, that house right there. And just like that, in 30 seconds, Ari's uh, pretty much got the hang of it. She's, she's able to steer the boat in a straight line, set her sail at a pretty decent. Uh, decent setting. Hit Joe up if you want to learn how to sail. <laughs> Joe Saucedo Sailing Charters. Instagram me right here. Just send me a DM or Snapchat or I don't know, however you want to get in contact with me. I'll take you out, teach you how to sail. We'll have a good time. Right, Ari? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now for the final challenge of our sailing trip. Backing this boat into that little slip that we were parked. It should be fun. Oh. Yeah. 
Here we are, we made it on the wakeboard boat. It's been quite a busy day, but I got some awesome people right here. I got Matt Larson, Christian Harsha, and we have Ben, who is our driver for today. He's gonna make sure we're nice and safe. I'm excited for this, but I'm not a good wakeboarder by any means. I can sail, but I cannot wakeboard. How about you guys? <laughs> Feeling good? We amateurs, yeah. baby. <laughs> we, we amateurs, did. we amateurs. Oh. You guys just make sure that rope doesn't get caught on the engine or anything. Alright, so I'll go good. You'll say yes. I'll take the slack out. I'll say here we go, and then we'll go. All right. Matt, that was quite the wipeout. <laughs> yeah, I felt that. <laughs> All right, it's been about an hour, I'd say, since we got off the wakeboarding trip. I took a shower, I actually took a quick nap too. And now, my friend Aiden, she's a super cool person. She actually reached out to me and asked if we could go get some dinner. So I'm always down to have a good time and have some good dinner. And play the piano too. And here we are, we have made it to downtown St. Pete. I'd like to welcome you to my friend, Aiden. Hello! <laughs> She's kind of an amazing person. She was one of the people who sort of helped me decide whether I wanted to come back or not. We probably had like five different conversations I know, about seriously. that. <laughs> We're going to a place called Red Mesa Cantina. They have really good outdoor seating, really good Mexican food. I'll probably get a quesadilla, so it should be quite fun. And it's not the calf. So. And it's not the calf. <laughs> Cafeteria food, like, it's just if you eat it multiple times every single day. Regardless of what school it is, if you're eating the same food from the same place, exactly, it gets old. Exactly, it's good to get out. Well, this is super cool. I had no clue that Red Mesa had a rooftop. It's, this is so nice. It is super nice. <laughs> this is perfect, honestly. Oh my goodness. I'm excited for my quesadilla. <laughs> it's so chill up here, too. It is. <laughs> Aiden, you look so funny with the blue. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have to give you our special food review of Red Mesa Cantina, give you uh, our approval or disapproval. We'll see how it is. <laughs> That's how you know it was good. Official review of Red Mesa Cantina. 10 out of 10. That was so good. Two Aiden, thumbs up. Two thumbs up. <laughs> By Aiden. <laughs> by Aiden herself. So Aiden hasn't been to the new St. Pete Pier yet. I've been twice so far. You went twice without me? <laughs> I know, I know. You gotta see it, it's incredible. Like, just the way they planned everything out, the sculptures and cool things, like, all right, check out this. 